Pamela Mwanza is working on her vegetable plot in northern Zambia. The upcoming harvest will be the first since she and her family fled an armed attack on her village in the Democratic Republic of the Congo. Like thousands of other refugees here, Mela arrived in Mantapala settlement in October last year. Zambia has included refugees in its recent national development plan. Farming households like Mela's are allocated half a hectare of land and given access to markets to sell their products. And it's not just farming. Congolese refugee Frederick Puta spent the last of his money to buy a sewing machine when he arrived in Matapala in January. Now business is booming for him, and he's employed five tailors to help out. Over 4.4 million people have been displaced in Congo in recent years. That was, in part, aggravated by a political crisis sparked by President Joseph Kabila's refusal to step down at the end of his mandate in 2016. The United Nations says over 700,000 Congolese refugees now live in sub-Saharan Africa.